The Global Social Media Impact Study is um, funded by the European Research Council and it's placing nine of us in eight towns, in eight countries, and we're doing a classical ethnography of each of those towns. And we're looking at how social media is used by people and we're contextualising that in their daily lives. I first came to Trinidad because my dad is Trinidadian, he's Indo-Trinidadian, so coming into Trinidad was, it's the first time I've done field work in a place where I've had a very ambivalent relationship as an insider and an outsider. Trinidad is a country of dualisms. On the one hand it's very traditional, it's very family oriented, it's very um, community oriented and on the other hand it's extremely futuristic and in many ways it's aspirational, again, according to its history. It's aspirational economically as it looks towards the US. It's, it's aspirational coming to terms with its own history as um, a colony and an empire from its legacy with the British and the French and the Spanish. So, and for this, it just has this mashup of past and present and future and cultures and religions. And I think a lot of those historical dynamics and economic dynamics and interpersonal dynamics play out on social media. In ethnography, the rapport that you build with informants, research subjects, is very important because you don't, we're not just collecting surveys and we're not just collecting interviews. We're trying to be around people when they're doing the most normal things and how they explain those normal things to themselves. So it takes a lot of time to build up trust, it takes up a lot of time to build up those relationships. Um, so I basically hung around until people get used to me or people like having me around. Every person I meet, I just want to spend more time with them and I like listening to them and then I like getting to know them. And in that, again, in that process of getting to know them, you have to give something of yourself. I'm a participatory anthropologist. Um, I probably participate more than I observe, but I find that, the again, the relationships that come from that are, are nuanced and they're rich. Some of the ways that I've gotten to know people is I suppose I've brought some of my skills to see how I can be useful to people. One seems to like nice photos taken of them, so I'll do that and then give them the photos and talk about them or put them on Facebook and tag them and then we'll sort of have a chat after that. I've also done a lot of stuff at the masquerade camp, so the mass camp. Um, they have these enormous beautiful costumes called King, Kings and Queens which they parade in the port of Spain, the capital city. The biggest social media in Trinidad is Facebook. Um, I started by organically making friends with people and organically building relationships with people. And then you know, my non-working hours when I'm on Facebook or when I'm doing writing or whatever, I'm sitting on Facebook or I'm checking people's pictures or checking their posts. You know, I like every now and then a comment. So I have a sort of benign presence that, um, as well on Facebook. So it seems like an, a normal friendship, which to me, they, it is a normal friendship. I mean, I. I I'd like to think I'm quite honest with informants with what I'm doing here. If, of course, when you say I'm doing my research on Facebook, everybody has an opinion on Facebook. So Facebook is one of the easiest kind of ins to get into to talking about what a society really thinks about its own society. Trinidad, part of its, its cultural logic is one of visibility. The way that visibility plays out in Trinidad I think is very specific and unique, but it's also another theme that people can relate to. People associate social media with externalization, a certain kind of narcissism, and a certain kind of duplicitous self-crafting. Whereas in Trinidad, the way that people relate to one another, people strive to be seen, and they strive to be seen in certain ways, um, where there's a, a positive and mutual recognition of each other. 